this is going to get interesting for Florida. I believe that the financial impacts of what Ron DeSantis and his legislature are doing will start to bite them in the butt in ways that they might not have anticipated. Now, I'm going to make a connection because everybody won't be able to see, well, what does insurance companies have to do? Okay, let's just read some of this. Farmers insurance pulls out of Florida, affecting 100,000 homeowners. Farmers Insurance Group announced Tuesday that it would no longer write new policies or renew existing homeowner auto or umbrella policies a day after Florida Chief Financial Officer Jimmy Petronis took to Twitter to threaten to take action if he did. Hearing rumors that we are farmers might pull out of Florida. If that's true, my office is going to explore every avenue possible for holding them accountable. Don't get to leave after taking policyholder money. A spokesperson for Petronis declined to explain what action he would take to hold the agency accountable, directing all questions to the Office of Insurance Regulation. Farmers released this statement in part, this business decision was necessary to effectively manage risk exposure. Florida law requires an insurer to give the state 90 days notice in writing if it plans to stop writing insurance or cancel 10,000 or more homeowner policies within 12 months. The insurer must also provide a reason that is permitted under state law before sending out non-renewal notices to customers. The company announced in June that it would no longer write new policies in Florida. It's the first time Petronis has called out specific insurance companies uh, for leaving the state after 10 others have already departed. Property owners are about to take a major hit on many different fronts. It's hurricane season. People are going to need to have their homes repaired. Also, because of SB 1718, um, the people who would normally be working construction are not working construction. So on top of their homes being destroyed, Insurance companies are fleeing and the people who would work on the homes are also fleeing and the insurance companies that are still providing insurance, those rates are skyrocketing. Okay, so this part right here, insurance companies have stopped writing policies, dropped customers and left the state outright after receiving $3 billion in taxpayer provided reinsurance to shore up the market. Florida is not making good business decisions. This is from another article, but it says over the past 18 months in Florida, 16 property insurance companies have decided to stop writing new business to homeowners in Florida in one form or another. You guys can read what I have circled in yellow. I will say this, Republicans going after culture wars versus financial wars will really impact people and the folks that keep voting for them are messing themselves up.